My name is Luis de Oliveira, and I run a design management company called De La Espada. I'm very happy to be at uh, Cubic in Tempelhof Airport in Berlin. We approach designers and we build small virtual companies around their name. They're very personal projects. Uh, they're projects that bear their name. They don't bear our name. And the designer has considerable freedom in delivering uh, their vision. Although many people know us as a company that manages designers, a very important heart of the company lies in our ability to make things. And the thing that we make best is furniture using wood. And most of our designers choose to work with that material, although they can work with many others. So here we have Studio Ilse. Ilse is a very interesting project for us. It's an ongoing project. She invited us to work using a local material, local to our factory. And she's developing a, what she calls a new vernacular, furniture that people have seen and relate to or throughout their life. And yet it's interpreted in a very cautious, careful and studied manner. De La Spada's first collaboration was with Autobahn, an Istanbul-based design office which is known throughout the world for their exuberant, baroque and very, very exciting projects. Here we show their latest work, which appeared also in London and shown in Germany for the first time, uh, namely the Daisy side table, the sweet bed and uh, the slice chairs. So Charlene Mullen is a UK-based textile designer a long uh, career designing textiles for fashion companies and in recent times she started her own small uh, company dedicated to home furnishings. Charlene, we were attracted uh, by her work with embroidery uh, interpreted in a contemporary sense referring to mid-century textiles as well. We're now looking at Soren Rose's uh, most recent efforts for Della Spada. Soren Rose Studio is a, a very interesting Danish design office his, his efforts are to use the Danish tradition of uh, design and interpret it in a more luxurious manner. So here we have the work of Benjamin Hubert, uh, a relatively young uh, designer based in London, who, who has a passion for exploring materials and developing products from the stories that those materials tell him. We are here on Matthew Hilton's um, stand. Uh, Matthew Hilton is uh, a designer who's well known in the United Kingdom with a 30 year career. And we're very proud to be able to support this work on, on a project that now is three years old. Matthew uh, launched uh, a number of new products in London only a month ago that we're showing here at Cubic as well. It's the first time in, in Europe that we're um, uh, showing his, his latest designs.